Yes, yes, yes. It's another one. It's Raphael Dawkins, the Combat Radio. And it is that hitting that bell icon if you enjoy the content but have not subscribed already. Okay, so the topic, today's topic for discussion is Andy Ruiz's weight loss. We thought it was mere speculation, but I have to say, for the first time, pictures have emerged which have me convinced that Andy Ruiz has indeed He's put down the tacos and the nachos. This is a picture posted on Michael Hunter's page, Instagram page. And uh, it shows Andreas the Ponce Ruiz has truly indeed slimmed down. Now, now we do the pictorial analysis we will see that Andy Ruiz's legs always seem to be undersized in, compared, in comparison to his upper torso. But now we see that differential has greatly declined, lessened. So if his legs are look, looking bigger, that means his upper torso has shrunken. Shrunken Ruiz, that's what I'm calling him. Shrunken Ruiz. Not Ruins, Ruiz. We'll see if he's in Ruins at the end of the fight in, uh, in this December the 7th in Daria, Saudi Arabia. That remains to be seen. See the chopped off hand there. Don't know what that's all about. Patting himself. Is he patting himself on the back? Well, if weight loss was his objective, then I think he, he does deserve a pat on the back. He can't afford to pat himself on the back because... For the first time, we see evidence that he truly has reduced, reduced his sugar intake. He's put down the tacos and the nachos. That's the question. Has Andy Ruiz put down the tacos and the nachos? Is he going easy on the extra cheese? Is he going easy on the extra cheesy? It certainly would appear so. I don't think this is a trickery. I don't think this is fault of shoppery. I think this is real. Andy Ruiz really has slimmed down. So it would appear. There is his former self. On the left, his current self on the right. Michael Hunter, his sparring partner. Yeah, sparring him with Michael Hunter. See my previous video for my breakdown of his sparring with Michael Hunter. And also, if you see my previous video, you'll also know that Michael Hunter is on the card facing none other than, none other than, Alexander Povetkin. Right about now, we're focused on, focusing on the body transformation. The body transformation of Andreas the Ponce Ruiz. Ruiz, as we know, will put his three heavyweight world titles on the line in his second fight against Anthony Joshua. And Ruiz has posted a picture alongside sparring partner, his sparring partner, Michael Hunter. And he looks a slimmed down version of the fighter who beat. Anthony Joshua. Ruiz accepted the challenge against Joshua at six weeks' notice in June before stunning the champion by knocking him down four times and uh, stopping him in the seventh. Referee waved it off. The Mexican American had come in for some criticism before the fight due to his chubby appearance and love of junk food. The tackles and the nachos. But having defied the odds in New York, he appears to have lost a considerable amount of weight before he faces Anthony Joshua again in Saudi Arabia, Arabia, Daria, 
on December the 7th. Where are we now? I think we are five weeks away. Five weeks away. And be sure to subscribe to Raphael Dawkins as we do Combat Radio, as we do the countdown to the fight. Five weeks away, ladies and gentlemen. If you have not already booked your tickets, then be sure to do so. And you know, for those who are not making the trek over to Daria, Saudi Arabia, you know that we will have coverage here on uh, Raphael Dawkins Combat Radio. We will be covering the live show with the live show. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. He has slimmed down tremendously, has the punch. So have your say. Have your say. It's a good thing. Does Ruiz need to need to be trimming down so much? Has he gone too far? Or has he not gone far enough? Has he gone too far? Have your say in the comment section. It's Raphael Dawkins. It's the combat radio. It's the like. It's the subscribe. It's the comment. It's the share. And it is the hitting that bell icon. And for sure, those of you with Twitter, go ahead and follow me on Twitter. Link in the description box. It's Raphael Dawkins. Combat Radio, and I'm out. Andy Ruiz Light. Will it be better for the fight? That is the question.